The opening casinos, Bally's reopened just a couple hours ago in the Las Vegas Strip. Hector Mejia was there for all the fanfare. The gaming and the hotel floors here at Bally's are back open with COVID-19 protocols in place, and they celebrated with a show that had some old Vegas flair to it. Three, two, one. Welcome to Bally's Las Vegas. At 10 o'clock Thursday morning, the iconic Bally's Hotel and Casino welcomed its first guest in almost four long months. It's the latest Caesars Entertainment property that's slowly reopening during the COVID-19 pandemic. The others back online include Caesars Palace, Flamingo, Harris, and Paris. We found close to 50 guests waiting outside Bally's for the gaming floors to reopen. I think we're making history right now. Yes. I think this is an iconic moment. Uh, yes. There's been a lot of places to come up and go down on the strip, and Bally's is still here, and he has a huge following. So it's a good thing to be a part of. We don't have images of the new experience because our news cameras were not allowed to go inside. We looked up room rates, though, for this weekend, in case you were wondering. For Friday, they start at $65 a night. The website also says they have complimentary self-parking. No word yet when the remainder of Caesars properties will reopen. That includes Planet Hollywood, the Link Hotel, Rio, and Cromwell. Reporting from the Strip, Hector Mejia, 8 News Now. Hector, the Tropicana will reopen on September 1st. Gaming machines will be socially distanced and valet will be closed. But the restaurants, pool, and spa will be open. You can start making reservations now.